All right, I have just lit up the fort. What is my hair? I'm a, I'm a brown David Hasselhoff. Anyways, <laughs> don't, don't take this down, TikTok. Everyone loves brown David, David Hasselhoff. Anyways, I just lit up the forge because... I'm testing a new steel. Now, I just got this from a scrapyard. It was like, you know, from the ground up to here, so about four foot. Um, and then I saw online guillotine tools. And I'm a blacksmith. I don't have a guillotine tool yet. I need one. So I thought, well, before I buy one, I'm going to make one. So I'm testing out this new steel. And I was cut as I was cutting it, the thing that made me want to test it is the sparks were looking kind of carbonated. So cut off a little piece. We're going to do a quench test to see if it's actually high carbon steel. Uh, maybe we'll find out it's mid carbon. I don't know. Anyways, here we go. Look at that. Shay's almost done cooking. The hills are alive. All right. So for those of you who don't know anything about carbonated sparks, basic, I'm getting a phone call. One moment. Okay, so. For those of you who don't know anything about carbonated sparks, basically it it's an indicator that there might be a carbon content in the steel. And carbon is what allows the steel to be hardened when it's quenched. So what I'm doing is I'm heating it up past critical temperature, way past, um, and then I'm just dunking it in a bucket of water. Because that will, if it has the sufficient carbon content, It'll get hard, and I will slap it in this vise, and I'm gonna hit it with a hammer. The thing to remember about post vices, you wanna yank it as hard as you can. Eh, just kidding, don't do that. You're gonna ruin your post vise. I am putting on uh, eye protection because uh, if it is hardened steel, this thing will snap and you can have little shards of metal just flying out at you. You don't know where they're gonna go. And you'll notice that this also covers the rest of my face because, well, let's face it, my cheeks are my money maker. So I am actually really surprised by that. I really thought this was gonna turn out to be carbon. Uh, but as you can see, uh, when I hit it, it did not snap, it bent. Which means not hard. Which means not carbon steel, which is okay. Cause up until now, I've just been using it as if it was mild steel. Uh, it's probably a bit more than mild steel. Uh, it looked like it might've been something structural. I don't know. It was in a junkyard, uh, but yeah. That's how we test. Bye.